Mitchell, I'm just here to offer my congratulations to you on a job well done. Congratulations on graduating from college. But more importantly, you are embarking on a lifelong journey of endless repairs. I'm telling you this now, endless repairs. But there are only two things you need as a homeowner that will serve you for the rest of your life. Scratch that. Three things. I want to begin again. Set sail and pull up my anchor. Forget about all of the dangers and just take it in I want to make hope, my friend Shake the dust and start over Before some sad son of a bitch told us all good things And I want to begin I want to begin again And again and again and again oh, I want to begin again and again and again and again and again. The first sir is this right here. This sir is duct tape. You can fix any damn thing with this. Anything. Anything. Hey, I mean anything. You got a problem? You got a leak? Duct tape. You got wood that broke? Duct tape. You got a hose that won't work? Duct tape. Duct tape. Next. I wanna begin again Drop all the pretensions and labels Kiss you under the table like when we were kids I wanna know love won't end We can take it back where we started Before all our friends got divorced and we turned into cynics I wanna begin again and again and again and again, oh, I wanna begin again. And again and again and again and again and again. This is your WD 40. Your WD 40. This is a lubricant. Talk to your father about the rest of the lubricants. This lubricant here is to be used for anything that's sticking, rusting, won't open. You can't tighten it. You can't open it. You gotta crank it. You gotta use this, okay? It even works on your mouth sometimes as a lubricant. Just telling you, get the jaw going. And the last but not least. I want to begin again. So many mistakes left behind me. But I'm not going to let them define me. But make me a better man. Because I want to begin again. And again and again and again. Oh, I want to begin again. And again and again and again I just want to begin again And again and again and again you know, The problem is that you're taking the pictures and you're not able to share them <laughs> And if you don't want it, don't worry about it We're going to take it and, you know, we're going to And the last but not least is your binder clips, your binder clips, Sonny. Right up here, look at this. I got binder clips everywhere. Look at this, binder clips. At a moment's notice, I can grab a binder clip, duct tape, and WT-40. Congratulations. What an accomplishment. Graduation, a job, and a homeowner. Repairs for the rest of your life. <laughs> We heard you buy a new house. When can we sleep over? Also, can we bring Chucky? You're first. I'm first? <laughs> You're first. Hey Mitch, it's your brother, uh, if you remember me. Congratulations, Mitch. We just wanted to say congratulations on your graduation. I know that your graduation is not what you were thinking it would be like, but anyway, we'll be watching you virtually. We're really happy for you. We're excited for you. And we're also excited about the house. I think that's really great. And um, you'll be getting a lawnmower. Wow. I heard it was graduation, so I thought I'd make a little video for you. I actually brought along my friend, uh, singer-songwriter Max Franco. 
What's up? Yara, Mitchie boy. Way to go, pal. Way to go. It's your cousin Chrissy from Boston. Just want to say congratulations on your degree. My God, you're wicked smart. Hi, Mitchell. Just want to say congratulations on graduating this year. Just feels like yesterday we were golfing at Mill Creek Short Holes. And I know you're going to go on to do great things. Congrats again. Hi, Mitch. This is Jesse from Finland. At first, congratulations for your graduation. It has been a pleasure to meet you. And it was so nice to play with you at YSU. I remember when we were on a power play. You, you make one chino when I passed you. That was a nice, nice one. Mitch, Tom Falloon here. From knowing you from playing hockey with my son many, many years ago to now graduating from Youngstown State University. That's great. What an accomplishment. Proud to say we're alumni. Proud to be a Penguin. Hey Mitch, congratulations buddy. Anthony from Buffalo. That's right, Buffalo, New York. The city of zero championships. Pretty awesome that you uh, graduated college, bought a house, getting married, having kids. Mitchell, congratulations buddy. Took you seven years. You're a doctor now, right? Congrats Mitchie. Congrats Mitchell, oh bye. Hey Mitch, and uh, here are the boys uh, fixing the barbecue. And uh, they're all very happy that uh, you have finished your career, your studies. Mitchell, what can I say? I saw you as a pup out at the Mill Creek Par 3, moaning and groaning that you had to be up that early in the morning. And now you're a college graduate with your YSU Honors degree. Wish you all the best. You're a good man. You come from a good family. I know your dad could never have been in the Honors Club like you and Chris are. Mitchell. Come back into town when you can, into Buffalo, and uh, we can give a beating over to uh, Ty and Aiden. It says coffee because adulting is hard. Welcome to adulthood. Congratulations to you, Mitch. Nice job. Round of applause. Way to go. Ooh, ooh. Congratulations on your employment with PDMI. As COO, very excited for you joining the team and can't wait to see all the accomplishments you make. I'm proud of you for graduating in this weird time, but I graduated before you, so I guess that means I'm smarter than you. Really proud of you for graduating and buying a house and getting a grown up job, <laughs> doing better than me already. Hey Mitch, wishing you all the best. We're very happy that you just finished your professional studies. You're a good man and we're very happy to have met you. Here you have your home here in Mexico, uh, and you're welcome to come down every time you want to come. Enjoy your professional life and have a lot of successes. Uh, keep it going, my friend, and we love you. Felicidades. Felicidades, Mitch. Congratulations on your academic achievement. Congratulations on employment achievement. And congratulations on your homeowner achievement. It's really something to be proud of. The engineering, job right away, a house, it's unheard of. Maybe even start a family or something soon, I don't know. At least we know this family can produce winners. I mean, look at me. I'm glad she spoke for both of us. Hey Mitch, congratulations. Uh, I know you really don't care about the graduation part, but- Being the eldest of three, you had responsibilities. And now they're kicking you out of the house to say, go on your own. It's okay, you'll make it. When the bars open up, we'll go back out. Uh, I want to say three memories. And the second one was our Buffalo trip. It was a funny weekend with you guys. And third one was when, we, when you were here and we went to, to my parents' place. And I show, I show you uh, a sauna and ice swimming. I hope that you enjoyed that a, lot, that a lot. Don't let anybody deter you from your dreams. Just remember, be a team player. Strive for excellence. You're done. Uh, well, you're never done learning. But uh, congratulations on the house. And I know your neighbors behind you are going to be really quiet, so that'll be nice <laughs> for you also. So I uh, look forward to coming over and having a cookout. And uh, make sure Ella cuts the grass once in a while. Absolutely. And uh, make sure you have a housewarming party so we can come over. Then I want to say you three things. 
Let's go to the bars. Let's go to the bars. Saturdays are for the boys. And third one, uh, just a little guy. You know that one. <laughs> just want to give you a shout out here from Boston and say congrats. I'm out. Hey, Mitch. Congratulations, man. Happy for you. Proud of you. Way to go, buddy. If you ever need anything, feel free to call. Congrats. And bye. So, anyway, congratulations. Yep. Congratulations. Congrats, Mitch. So, good luck. I'll be seeing you soon. Congratulations, Mitchell. Congrats, bud. Good for you. You're going to do great things with your life, Mitch. Proud of you. Congratulations. Hi, people. It's Kenny Rogers. Got a special request from a friend of mine. His name is Mitch. He's graduating. Seems he's doing pretty good up there, but I've invited a very special friend of mine to help me say it. Dolly. Hi, Kenny. How you doing? Oh, Kenny, I'm just fine. I've been lost in your house looking for your wine cellar. So how are you and the twins doing? Oh, Kenny, we're just Okay, so here's the song I was thinking of. It was a song by me and Lot. Take off your glasses. You gonna have to take uh, off your glasses? Forgot that. So here's the song I've been thinking about. If you could help me with it, I'd be very much appreciative. Sure, Kenny. Mitchie. You're a knight in shining armor, and we love you. You have made us so proud. But we won't help you with your down payment. Oh, Mitchie. There's so many ways we want to say congratulations. You have come into the dark game of life and hit the hole. You have gone. And already got a job. We're so lost in your story. Oh, 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 oh. We belong together. Why are you four hours from the bird? Mitchie, for so many years we watched you grow and make it. You have taken your life and Conquered it. We figured we'd make a little song for you today. One, two, three. Congratulations on graduation. You are growing. Now you'll be going. Not far in life without a wife. And people stare. So cut your hair and lose your beer belly. Shower more smelly. Good luck. Congratulations. Oh, I might have gotten carried away there. And then I hope that. I see you so soon, bro. And take care. Congratulations on graduation. You have a job and a house. We'll be sleeping on your couch. We're so happy for you. Congratulations, Mitchell. This is Mitchell's graduation song. Take infinity and beyond. I didn't write this song, I just changed some of the lyrics for my boy Mitch. For the last 23 years, your life's been pretty smooth. But let's take a moment and reflect on all you've had to do. You rolled out of bed and into the living room and watched Cartoon Network while your mom made pancakes for you. Your laundry was magically clean and your dad's back pocket was ostensibly an ATM machine do you hear that buzzing sound it's the sound of your neighbor's dog shitting on the lawn and then he walks away without cleaning it up and you stick your head out the window and you're like hey man you gonna clean up after your dog and he goes my dog didn't do that and you're like dude I saw your dog shit He's like, what, you calling me a liar? Like, yeah, I'm calling you a liar. He's like, well, why don't you come fucking make me clean it up, asshole? Oh, Flash probably should have cursed. Oh, my God. Please bleep that out or something. Can you do that? Are you good that? Are you that good, Toddy? Well, now you're on your own. You 
should be scared But I can tell That you're not scared You should be scared You should be terrified Because now everything's your fault Well Now you've got your freedom And the world is your oyster I don't really know what that means But let me paint a picture of your future you can eat a lot of Hot Pockets, and I know this sounds pretty great, but talk to me in six months when you've had like 408. Do you hear that buzzing sound? It's the, it's the sound of your pipes expanding because it's really cold in the wintertime. You really don't want that. If they ever burst, you're kind of fucked. So just... Well, now you're on your own. You should be scared But I can tell That you're not scared I ah, see, you were probably should be asked You got a great support system behind you, buddy I love you Kenny And Dolly We just want to say congratulations I think I might have a little touch of that COVID <laughs> Good night Kenny, good night